and Shitari float. Welcome back, Take guys. Take your foot off its head. Welcome back to another Marvel. What, what's not to get? Of Guardian. Marvel's Guardian to Galaxy video. Chalo, hum log continue kar lete hain. Baap kam karunge. Rendezvous coordinates are that way. But we'll have to find a way around the rubble. I'll try to find a side passage. Thank you, Bruce, for helping me. Look at this old beauty. Ooh. A table. This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear. Hey, hand me that part. A workbench with rockets help use a workbench to craft perks. Available perks are displayed when you activate it. Each perk requires specific components. A mining, to craft. mining ship. Cut right. rock, extract resources. Do you see any rock? You have enough components to craft equipment this for that matter. Perk. Well, no. Rapid reload. Ah, oh, nice. Hey, Quill! Groot says there might be something behind the big unit over here! Yeah, mining. Rapid reload to move again. Yeah, there's a way through, if we can clear out that crud. Yeah, that's one stubborn bunch of blorf. Try that quick cooldown I installed, so you can keep pelting it. Come on, Quill, put them pea shooters to good use, so we can squeeze in there. Ooh, I You gotta time it just right to overcharge the phase cooler. Oh yeah! Ooh. Nailed it! <clears throat> and uh... Rapid uh, reload allows you to cancel your element gun school down and deal extra damage. Green zone, press over the green zone, okay. Who pele bol na ta lode, me karne ke baad hai. Khud karne ke baad bol after you. Seems a little wobbly. You guys hang back a sec. This place is crawling with ugly. Guys, I'm not alone down here. Holy crap! This is the most punchable thing. I've ever seen! <laughs> right in the face! Thing! Okay, hot to be marked back, yeah? In some cool. Peter Quill, I have located some old equipment, but I do not see you. This whole place is old equipment. That does not narrow my search. Okay, guys. Try to score. We are done, now. Come on, come on. We are You two have any luck? It is not a question of luck. Peter, make some noise so we can find you. Drax? Drax! Uh, hey, you want to mute your comms if you're going to scream your lungs out? What's up, man? 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 I don't know. Weird QB hunks of rock or metal. 
I wonder if Rocket knows what this is. Put it away, sir. Guy. New Guardian collectible found. Okay. Final conclusion. Rocket might have something interesting to say about it when you go back to lab. So look at it. Can you come back to me, then? Okay, that is careful. Hello. I can make it up there, but we're gonna need something for you two to climb up on. There's a wonder the nimble assassin has not abandoned us already. Drax. At least he called me nimble. It was not intended as a compliment. Right, pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. Somehow. It's a possibility. Maybe try something else. Anyone got any bright ideas? If you're not gonna use that visor, give it to me. She covets the forbidden knowledge of your magic glasses, Peter Quill. That crate is being held up by this crane. We could free it. Let's see that fancy footwork, Gamora. Bet you can't do this. Watch your head! It's physically Drax. impossible. Drax, think you can heft that container? Behold the might of a Katathian warrior! Can you move it over there? Done. Where is the marker? I would have got it, Pura. Hey, no, no, no. That's helpful. I did as our leader bid. Not all of us are so quick to disobey. 
Make up your mind. Are you mad I served Thanos or that I betrayed him? Neither inspire confidence. <laughs> Remember this moment should you ever think of crossing the assassin. I'll remember how slowly All right, Rocket. We're back on track. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, good for you. I am good. It ain't stealing if it's abandoned. We... Oh, fuck. Rocket. Not now, Quill. Check it out. Ah. Wait, I'm going to go to my bed. My bed. My bed. Rocket! Perhaps he has located our monster. We don't even know what it looks like. You know, it's extremely vague. It wasn't vague, it was rushed. It's probably some cute little. Nightmarish abomination. Lady Hellbender is a renowned warrior. Maybe we would have gotten along. I bet it's something cute. Women dig the cute stuff, right? All women in the entire universe get weak in the knees when they see something. You've never seen a baby otter playing with its hands. Let's just focus on running. Kuch so bola tha wo chat. Groot ka ability use karke hum log ko bagne theek hai. Samjh mein aaya? Chalo. Have to run, dude. Fuck it. Well, you got some time and we got company. Is this from the last stumper? Monsters! They are food for our glory. We'll not be far behind. Let's just focus on not becoming food ourselves! We need to regroup! You're right! This isn't working! Mark, mark, mark! It's like you woke up the whole ship! Just hang in there! Guys, huddle up! Oh it feels like they're everywhere, laughing at us! And yet, we cannot retreat! No one wants to retreat, big guy, but I gotta say, it's and scary out there, Quill! Hard darts on the field! Danger on all sides! Then it's time we stand and face it, and make sure they're nullified! Are we heroes to be laughed at? No! I'll laugh at them instead! Who's with me? Die! Please! Can't wait to take him down! You said- Oh my god, ooh! I didn't have three possible outcomes. You motivated the team by answering color two. Fuck yeah! Both you and Guardians can get it this way, I know. Had he chosen wrong, only you have, would have gotten. Win, lose, or stay nothing. All Guardians. Okay, got it. But I... Woo! Show him your wounds! Or a rousey! Peter Quill, sometimes he ain't half bad. Kill 
my rock! Ha ha ha! Their ocular cavities are weak! Well destroyed, big guy! We ain't such a bad team after all! You kidding? We're the best! Get some! Get some! Take the whole clip! I will destroy you all! Hey, not all of us! Do this before I can get back up! Let's find a soft spot! Oh, I wonder if their shiny bits are worth anything! that? Come on, last thumper spot is this way. How do you know? My senses are fine-tuned to measure even the tiniest vibrations. Really? No, I'm tracking it on my display. It looks like it's still got some juice. Give it a go, Rocket. Watch a genius at work. You are a miracle worker, man. This tech was built by people who make all those giant floating space rocks. I have to say, that is an immaculate parking job. Never been a... Yeah, yeah. This is it. Last spot. I can't wait to be out of here. This place feels like it's about to collapse on itself. I cannot wait to meet our monster. I thought you were mostly interested in meeting the buyer. She is a respectable collector. Is it working? Yeah, yeah, don't worry, sunshine. <laughs> Ow! Is it, uh, doing it? What? It appears to be broken! Ain't nothing broke! That's the sound it's supposed to make! What sound? You can't hear that! Hear what? Oh! Hey, what's that? What's that? Door, we <laughs> works. Let's catch our monster. Where the Man, that thing is fast. Don't let it get behind you. It could be poisonous. The vendor will pay extra if it is poisonous. That's one less thing to hide behind. Does it look friendly? Looks like a monster to me. Abomination, perhaps you speak it. It's more in common with you. String them up! What the flark is what that? Fuck? Definitely not a monster. <laughs> Adorable. It's more matted than an Asgardian goat. We cannot present this pathetic creature to the monster queen of Sektoff 9. She will laugh at us. Maybe we can use it as bait. <gasps> I knew those thumpers wouldn't work. What? My thumpers are state of the art. Musclehead's the one who rushed at the first thing that came through the door. My head is not made of muscle. You guys seeing what I'm seeing? Yes. Now that is a monster. Alright. Enough with the warm-up. Time to catch us a real monster. 
Let's get paid. What in hell's name is that? Definitely not cleaner bots. Watch it! Whole place is crapping out. We gotta get out of here! Now! Curse these volatile ruins! Tracks, go! Hold on to your butts, people! Rocket, hit the music! On it! Focus on flying, Peter! Some From. Means you screwed up because you had to fly away from it. Uh, please don't be Nova Corps. Please don't be Nova Corps. Please don't be Nova Corps. It is Nova Corps. Hallis Hope. Uh, did you say Hallis Hope? Um, <clears throat> there's a uh, uh, thing I got. I gotta do. Uh, I'll be right back. We need to get rid of that animal now. <sighs> I'm serious, Peter. If it stays on the ship, we all go to prison. No one's going to jail. Yeah. It's a harmless space llama thingy. Harmless? Remember Anakubi? Uh, not really. No. That's because they scorched the planet because an idiot smuggled in an Exelon. I will eject the beast into space. Whoa, 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 we're not ejecting anything. It'll make us look guilty. <laughs> it could be carrying Zephron's disease. Which is why Drax is gonna hide in the secret cargo compartment behind Groot's plants. Peter, Jason, Quill. Really, my middle name? Hey, Corell! How you doing? How long's it been? Two, three years? You look good. You been tanning? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you. Corral. I swear it's not what it looks like. 
that you're a junker trespassing in the most restricted area of space? Who consorts with thieves and murderers, apparently? Hey, killing people for money ain't murder, lady. Nice to see you too, Coral. <laughs> Funny story, actually. The nav crapped out and routed us through the quarantine zone. Your navigation malfunctioned. What can I say? As soon as we noticed the air, we plotted a course out, and that's when you showed up. Right. Peter Quill, I found these items in the uh, space that you told me about. There was not enough room for both the other thing and these. Peter Quill? Of planet C-53, under galactic law ZXP-47, I am putting you and your crew under arrest for Actually, can I call you back? What? Please, tell me that is not a crate of super illegal tech. It is a crate of super illegal tech, which also happens to be very valuable. Really? What? We're on a Ravager ship, even the Flark and Bulkheads are stolen. Well, we can't fit both in the compartment. I will eject the crate into space. Eject the crate and I melt your face! The Milano's weapon systems are four generations behind, Quill. We need that tech, more than we need some stupid farm animal. That farm animal could be a class three biohazard. You want to end up in the kiln? I am oh, Airlock. Oh, I really shouldn't have hung up on her. What about the crate? Leave it. I'll handle this. Krell and I have history together. You slept with a cop? She wasn't a cop at the time. The point is, I will get us out of this. Trust me. to meet with law-breaking pirates like you. That's just it, we're not pirates. We're legally incorporated heroes for hire. Yeah, that's right, you check those records, Buckethead. Novacor Licensing Permit 67398-2. Gardeners of the Galaxy? What? No. Rocket. So, I let Groot fill out the paperwork. I fixed it with an addendum. Not the most well-known heroes you could hire, but definitely in the top five of most awesome names. Contributing members. Groot, a Flora Colossus. Last of his kind, fearless in a firefight, an awesome best friend. Rocket, bona fide super genius and a wizard with explosives. Definitely not a raccoon. Gamora, adopted daughter of Thanos, deadliest woman in the galaxy. Need we say more? Drax the Destroyer, convicted serial murderer and galactic war hero? Often grumpy. Last and definitely least, Peter Jason Quill. That's it? <laughs> That's all you wrote? It was a character limitation. <sighs> Sorry, excuse me, I just need to... Cadet Gold, what are you doing here? Oh, you don't know? Really? It says right here. Prisoner processing training. I'm your official trainee. <laughs> Aren't you a little young for the core? Aren't you a little old for that hairdo? I should check with the captain. No! Uh -oh. No, 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 she, she definitely signed off on this. You know how thorough she is about signing stuff? If I may, sir, the real concern here is Regulation 7A regarding prisoner footgear. That one's jet boots are in clear violation. They're decorative. Good work, Cadet Gold. Great. There goes Plan B. We don't need a Plan B. I got this. No. You do not got this, pirate. I got this. Now fall in line. I have to go, prisoners. Hey, watch the jacket. Cadet Gold. You know the arrest protocols? All memorized, sir. First thing we do... First thing you do is apologize. We're legitimate business-like folk on legitimate-like business. We're not hunting an illegal creature in illegal space. Illegal. Stop helping. We said we were not. Here's what they say against them, right? Absolutely. Yes. Fuck. I missed it. Hold it right here. Is there a problem? Yes! No faith energy, no power. No power. No containment. 
a single spot. The techs are looking at it. They say that... They cannot even fathom. How can they fix what they cannot understand? Put the Grand Unifier's mind at ease. Run the scanners again. What the flark is a Grand Unifier? Grand Unifier Raker. Leader of the Church of... Universal... something. He was floating dead in the quarantine zone. Looking for God, All right, pirates. Let's go. We caught him just like we caught you. Difference is, I know the captain. As I was saying, just tell the captain that I- Mom explicitly said she doesn't want to see you. Yeah, Quill. Just to be super clear on the mom thing. <laughs> hold on! Quill! Peter! Hold on to something, Quill! No, 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 no! भूल गया जेट बूट ऑफ पे करके छूते ऐसे खोद लिया You, Nikki. <laughs> okay, Nikki, here's the plan. You're gonna jump and grab my legs while I hold on for dear life. That doesn't sound like. Trust me, kiddo. We got this. See? <laughs> this is so weird. Good hold. Doing great. Okay. That was kind of amazing, huh? <laughs> Whoa! <sighs> Thanks. Mom wouldn't be impressed if I lost my first prisoner. <laughs> Your mom, right. Come on. We need to get out of here. There's a blast door around the corner. We'll be safe there. Here. Help me with this. Ready? Together. On three, two, one. Go, go. Okay. We need to keep moving. This way. Yeah, Nikki. Whoa. Just stay close. I knew there was something wrong about that church. Who goes fishing for God in a junkyard? Oh man, this is bad. Blast doors kick in during emergencies. Pretty sure I can override them with my passkey. They give out override keys to trainees? Not exactly. Just give me a sec. Come on. You no, know, I could probably help with the door if we undid these cuffs. Regulation 3B. Never undo restraints. Oh, come on. You clearly need my help. No! You're my prisoner. And I got this. <sighs> Obviously. Ah! Okay, we're gonna have to find another way. We sure there isn't a way through here? I'm in charge. Whoa! <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You? Oh, dandy. Okay, this way. Shouldn't we be going up? Back toward the others? There's another blast door down here. Whoa! Are you kidding me? Relax, you're fine. I mentioned how useful my jet boots will be right now. Okay, I can do this. Not to rush you or anything. Almost there. Yes, got it. Through here. Whew. <laughs> nice work. Thanks. Nice you work. didn't do too bad yourself, pirate. Only Star Lord, or Peter, or you know, Nova Cadet Butt Saver. Okay, Peter. So, listen, I have some good news. 
and some bad news about your friends. Uh, start with the bad, I guess. Your friends have been processed and put in the brig. So what's the good news? They're not dead. Come on. Welcome. Flark! Pipes must have burst. Should we try using that thingamajig of yours to call someone? We don't need help. I know what I'm doing. Now help me block this fire so we can get through. Sure. Just that everyone must be worried. Cap easy does it. There, see? You don't need to worry about me. Enough people around here do that already. Look, there's the adult in the room. <laughs> Adult isn't exactly how my mom described you. How did Carol describe me? Is that robot wearing makeup? What? Oh, yeah. That's just it's. I um I know all the bots down here. They're kind of my friends, I guess. I most of them. And gave them faces. Maybe. No, I mean it's cool. Gives them personality. Very cool. Does your mom know you play down here? Probably not. But what else am I gonna do? Not like there's any other kids on board. You know, I didn't have a lot of friends at your age either. Granted, I was in prison, but still. So mom was right about you. It was a Shatari prison. I was just a kid. I have so many questions. How do you know my mom, exactly? Uh, we fought together on Mercury during the war. She was, a, is, a real spitfire. More like real controlling. And bossy. And judgmental. You're just a kid, Nikki. You don't know what's good for you, Nikki. Stay out of the escape pods, Nikki. Pretty sure all kids get annoyed with their moms. But, as you get older, you realize they're right more often than not. Ugh. Whatever. Are you sure this is the quickest way to the brig? I thought you didn't want to go to the brig. Okay. Just trust me. I want to show you something. This way. Cool. If this is an attempt to escape your mom's ship, I really need to know. Because I may or may not be super interested. Just <laughs> really need to make sure it doesn't look like a kidnapping. What? No! No! Oh, wow! Don't, Don't laugh. Is this your mom? Single-handedly winning in a war? No. That final push was, uh... It was a massive team effort. Were you there? Uh, I contributed to the war effort differently. Pirating? Raiding. Which is, you know... Hey, hey! Off limits. No adults. I get it. Anyway, I'm all done here. We should probably get back before Mom completely freaks. Yeah, yeah, I've seen your mom overreact before. I'm not a kid anymore, you know? No. Tell me about it. So, you get where I'm coming from, right? Like, if I do end up talking to my mom, the subject of me happens to come up. Say no more. I'll make sure Corral knows what a good job you No, no! I mean, I mean, thanks. But I mean, I really... Mom never needs to know. So, so I, I never saw, saw you. you. Exactly. Never saw me. 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 Never Take a deep breath and recognize that maybe we've all made some mistakes. Make sure the fire is out and the hangar secure. Yep, yes, Commander. And find out why that church shuttle exploded. Rainier Fire Raker has been less than cooperative. Make him cooperate. And you two? 
I knew you'd overreact. You always overreact. Even Peter was saying so. Oh, he was, was he? <laughs> I suspect Peter misspoke something he often tends to do. So I suggest you worry less about what he said and more about what I'm saying now. For what it's worth, Nikki totally saved my butt. She handled herself really well. You have every reason to be proud of her. Coming from you, Peter, it's worth extraordinarily little. Why are you being mean to him? Just listen to what he's saying. I don't care what he's saying. Upper level. Captain's quarter. Finally. Initiate lockdown. Lockdown initiated. <laughs> what, are you gonna kill us? In theory, these doors don't open until I say so. Yeah. I know how lockdown works. I don't think you do, because somehow you keep bypassing every security measure on this ship, and I want to know how. Or you can just show me. Mom! <laughs> I seriously have no idea what you're talking about. Initiate not lockdown. All good for systems go. Activate. Voice print not authorized. Just trying to help. <laughs> we don't need your help. You're the last person we need help from. Well, you clearly need some form of help if you're trapping us in an elevator. No one leaves until you tell me what I want to know. You already know everything! No, I don't. I know you're a magnet for danger. And that you somehow keep getting caught in restricted areas of this ship. I'm small. Okay? I fit into places. Being small doesn't get you past security. Or through the hangar bay checkpoint. There was that system-wide glitch, remember? Yeah. Yeah, security was down for a while. No, it wasn't. Seemed pretty down to me. Are you seriously lying for a 12-year-old right now? 12? Oh, wow, I thought she was at least 16. Peter! What? <laughs> like, she really knew her stuff. She's a smart kid. Too smart. She keeps bypassing security. Unless... You have a level 6 access to my ship all of a sudden? Didn't think so. Nicolette Gold, empty your pockets. No. You empty your pockets. Nikki? What? I know you're hiding something. I still have feelings for you. <laughs> Excuse me? Not like... <laughs> feelings, feelings. More like... Emotions. You know, because the explosion and me and you and everything we went through back in the war. There was a lot of feelings to both. I'm good now. Okay, good. Now, if you don't mind. Look, Mom, I, I'm not hiding anything. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. To be continued. Disengage lockdown. Lockdown disengage. So, can I go help secure the hangar now? No, you can go back to your quarters and you can stay there for the next 30 rotations. But, Mom! I can make it 30 cycles. So, rough day, huh? Exploding shuttles, quarantine zone trespassers, missing kid. I have no idea. Chewy. I can't believe you still have him. I can't believe you survived. Mercury was what, like a thousand degrees? More like a thousand cycles ago. You can keep him if you want. He is yours. Hey, I ordered him to look out for you. Expect him to keep doing his job. Especially... Twelve-year-old daughter? We didn't have during the war. Twelve years ago, when we... Peter. When we picked up your ship, part of me was excited. At first. But then after all this time, you haven't changed. 
at all. You're still the same. I've changed. Whatever the fine is, I'll pay. Just give me three cycles. Let me prove that I'm not still whatever it is you're going to finish that sentence with. You're going to pay 9,000 units in three cycles. Wow, that, okay. That is a lot of money. Look, here, I was thinking that the maybe... The fine's non-negotiable. My search party found a disturbing amount of prohibited tech lying around your ship and a Class II biohazard. I couldn't decide which one to hide. Peter. Okay, okay. You'll get your money on time, no problem. This Guardians of the Galaxy thing, we are this close to getting it off the ground. And if I didn't have these handcuffs on, I would show you just how very close we are. Why do I feel like I'll regret this? Oh, come on. When have I ever... You won't regret it. I promise. You've got three cycles, Peter. Not four, not five, three. Contact me when you've got the units. And if we don't? The device we installed will deactivate your ship, and you will all go to prison. Gotcha. We won't let you down. <laughs> you said you could get us out of this. I did. 9,000 units is a small price. 9,000 units? That is a tremendous sum. Where are we going to get that kind of money in three cycles? By robbing a freaking bank, apparently. Okay. So we got fined. So we have a Nova tracking thing on our ship that's going to shut down our engines if we don't pay that fine in three cycles. At least we're not on a prisoner transport. Not yet. Come on, guys. You're Drax the Destroyer, man. You killed Thanos. Allegedly. Are you gonna let a little fine slow you down? And Gamora, you're practically an MI6 agent, but way hotter and cooler. There's nothing you can't do. Here it comes. Rocky, you're an actual genius and the scrappiest dude I know. How many prisons did you break out of? Seven. Seven. You are Groot. Oh, cool. <laughs> We're supposed to be a team. All we need to do is figure out how broke we are and come up with a plan. So check your quarters. Check between the sofa cushions. Check under the crafting bench. If you find any spare units lying around, grab them. I'll do the same in my quarters. All right. This is why you don't sleep with cops, Quill. They put bombs on my ship. My ship. What's that supposed to mean? It is common knowledge that rodents hoard nuts, stolen technology, units. <sighs> okay, first off, I ain't a hoarder, nor a rodent. I know you have a stash hidden aboard this ship. Fetch it now. There ain't nothing to fetch. Groot blew our stash on Contraxia, and the rest I gave to. Why don't you go bother someone else? I intend to. Why does this thing look so sinister? I don't go into your room and touch your stuff, Quill. What? You Open hacked my door. visor and added a scoreboard there, to it tree. while I was sleeping. <laughs> eh, that was different. I improved. I do not know what also, did up. anyone tell you that you snore? I thought Drax Your was bad, but Token's wow. Has clearly well, stashed his illicit you should really get that checked. You sound like a Torg. I am watching I you. Treat. Snore that loud? <laughs> yeah, okay. So what is this thing anyway? It kind of looks like a metal face hugger. That is clearly a spinal control unit. Yes, right, of course, a, a spinal control thingy. Back on Half World. Three scientists use these to keep us super soldiers in line. Uh, they'd press a big, fun red button and zap! Instant obedience. Holy crap. Ooh. Rocket. What you guys?
What exactly did the Kree do to you? They ripped me apart and rebuilt me over and over and over again until I became this half-finished thing they could mold and shape and control. Oh, Rocket, I had no idea. I mean, I knew the Kree Empire was desperate, but... Do you know what it's like to lose all control of your body? To be in constant pain, trapped inside yourself, and able to stop the horrible things you're doing? <laughs> that control unit made sure I did what I was supposed to do. Oh yeah, whether I wanted to or not. <laughs> A neat, furry little machine of death. Didn't take long. Okay. Then let's shoot this thing out the airlock. Uh, yeah. I don't think I'm ready to let go of that part of me yet. Are you 100% sure? Controls me! Ah, I decided yeah, as far as I'm concerned. How many of you super- When the Kree started, a hundred. She was the first one not to die from the control unit. Mm -hmm. And Lila is also a- What? A raccoon? Yeah. Or not a raccoon? You gotta understand. She was afraid of- Oh, that sounds- So, I did what I do best. I found a way to- I blew a hole into the side of the- What we did in the lab was modulator freak- She can't buy- Got over here. Thing? Well, well, well. Let's see if we can find some stray units in here. Really? Thirty-seven units? <laughs> we appear to be 8,963 units short. If we intend to keep our ship, Peter Quill... I know, I know. We clearly... Need a plan. And reconsider my initial proposal. Oh, no, not Fin Fang Foom again. Yes, we should go after Fin Fang Foom. Drax, there are easier ways to get paid. Like, what about selling Gamora's crap? What? Oh, come on, you've been hoarding them stupid knickknacks ever since you first joined us. I mean, don't tell me they ain't worth nothing. The quarantine zone was always She's holding out on My figurines are not knickknacks. Huh, team's in trouble. Then you can't be bothered to make no sacrifice. Set course for the I will star sacrifice system. your head. And take us to the majestic mount. Guys! Let's just hear Drax out this time. Fin Fang Foom is the fiercest, most legendary monster in the galaxy. Shatters the bones of all who go after it. The skulls of the greatest hunters are impaled upon its fangs. Imagine the glory of such a death. Our goal isn't death, Drax. Glorious death! Out of the question. Well, in that case... You're not selling my stuff! I am Groot. I am... He says we should combine both ideas. Sell Gamora's trinkets to Fin Fang Foom. It is brilliant. Yeah, you know, the only problem with your plan is that Lady Hellbender only buys monsters, and you are not a monster. He's not. He's the sweetest, most... I am Groot. No, you don't. This ain't something you can pretend. I am Groot. Oh, yeah? You want monster? Oh, I'll show you monster! Oh, oh guys! Groot, are you really offering to- No, no, he is not offering that, okay? It could work. Tell Groot, I guess we could bust him out after. Absurd. Lady Hellbender seeks the monster within. The small ugly one is clearly the correct choice. He is cruel, sadistic, and his soul is filthy and filled with rage. Monster Queen would pay a great sum for such a creature. Really? How great? <laughs> How are you okay with this? Because I know what I am. And I know what he ain't. I am Groot. I vote we sell Groot. I honestly think Lady Hellbender will go for it. Yeah, well, I vote for not Groot. 
I also vote for the creepy little beast. Two votes each. Peter? Rockets definitely scarier on the inside, more convincing. Well, I think Groot's more convincing in the traditional monster sense. Groot, buddy, first of all, thank you. And second of all, I want you to know we're gonna bust you out of there right after, okay? God. I am Groot. All right, let's do this. Let's go sell a monster. Seriously flying into that. You say the weather patterns of Seknarf 9 are tied to the temperament of its ruler. That's not how women work. Or weather. Anyways, I'm sure it looks worse than it is. Quill, I don't want to walk in this. Well, <laughs> yep, no problem. Yep. We're flying the way. Nah, no, he's not flying. Guys, relax. Just one minor adjustment. <laughs> Piece of cake. <sighs> you can't be serious. What? This way we can scope things out before we finish the transaction. We're like a hundred clicks from her base. You know how much I like scoping. Oh. Nope. Okay. ठीक है. ये next objective हम लोग next video में करेंगे. ये video में इधर तक ही रखते हैं हम लोग. Thank you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, why don't we ever get missions on night? Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for watching.